Well, many in our community have come together to stop hate in wake of the shooting that killed eight Asian people in Georgia. But how can we do this productively? Here to explain how faculty and students at the University of Toledo are addressing diversity and anti-Asian hate is Dr. An Zhang Zheng. Dr. An, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Good morning. Thank you for having me. So how is the university, you know, UT tackling this tough issue? Um, for the time, um, university, um, different organizations is, are coming up to create this um, town hall meeting to encourage dialogue and exchange. So the Office of uh, Diversity and uh, Inclusion, the Office of Multicultural Student Success, and uh, the Asian Studies Program came up to um, organize this events of diversity on um, uh, uh, dialogue on diversity. What's the, you know, so, kind of the hope and the goal from this? You know, what are you really hoping people come away with? Yeah, we hope people understand that Asian Americans and Asians are very diverse. Um, it's typically people think of uh, Asian Americans are Asians from East Asian countries like Korean, Japan, or China. Um, but actually, um, there are a lot of people from Vietnam, Thailand, Indonesia, India. So it's a huge area um, of the countries. So we hope people would understand that uh, Asian Americans have been in the United States um, for many, for centuries. And historically, Asians are considered a foreigners. That's why we saw the um, Chinese Exclusion Act, Act in 19, 80, uh, 1882. Uh, even during the World War II, we saw this uh, Japanese internment. Um, unfortunately, um, we know that there has been a historic uh, institutionalized racism against Asian Americans. Uh, we hope with this recent event, um, this in, during this year of a pandemic, um, the rise against Asian Americans could raise our awareness about the issue, um, not just only from the history, um, with current tension between uh, China and the United States. Um, there are there's layers of issues. However, the anti-Asian hate should not be continued. We need to stop this in all ways. So we hope people coming up from this event um, by understanding better the, the roots of the problem and how we can stand in solidarity to support um, the Asian Americans and support the unity of all groups in the United States. Absolutely. It sounds like you're really trying to fight ignorance and make sure people understand what it's like to be an Asian American or someone who's in the United States who maybe doesn't fit into the normal cultural norms. When is this town hall going to be happening and who can join? Uh, it will be a public event uh, so anybody can participate. It will be th this coming week, Saturday at 6 at 12 p.m. from um, 12 to 1. So it will be on WebEx. Gotcha. So people need to go on WebEx. Do they need to register in advance or they can just show up and attend it? Um, they can just click on the link awesome. um, on the event. Yeah. So you said next Saturday um, and uh, when? P Tuesday. Sorry. Tuesday. Thank you. Got it. So next Tuesday, we see it there on the screen. Next Tuesday, April 6th, and you said at noon. Um, Whenever people are attending this as well, at the end, I understand that you want to have a, a discussion. You know, people are going to talk about their experiences, and you really want people to be able to hear from different Asian Americans, people of all walks of life. Is that right? That's right. Uh, we cannot include too many people on the panel, but we will try to make it as, uh, as representative as possible. Basically, in this event, we hope uh, audience also participate in this dialogue and the discussion, awesome. um, sharing with us their experience and how we can work together 
to stop the hate. Dr. On, thank you so much for joining us and sharing a great resource and ways that people can get involved this morning. We appreciate your time. Thank you, thank you very much.